Someone there? Whoever you are, I know how to use this. Oh, jeez. Here we go. When I first heard about Detective Pikachu, I was excited to do a film that my kids would love and then I could watch with them. I know. You can't understand me, but put down the stapler or I will electrocute you. Detective Pikachu's got some sass. He's got some serious attitude. He's kind of a larger than life character and he has to be. I mean, he looks like a little yellow cotton ball. So I'm trying to bring as much personality out through the character as I possibly can. Did you just talk? Oh my God, you can understand me. Stop. I've been so lonely. This contradiction of seeing this cute, cuddly thing have Ryan Reynolds' voice. Bingo, la cucaracha. It's incredible. <laughs> you can hear him, right? Pika Pika! Yeah, Pika Pika Pika, he's adorable. You're adorable. They can't understand me, kid. Can no one else hear him? In Rhyme City, humans and Pokemon live side by side as partners. Tim meets Pikachu and slowly starts opening up. What is that? Silent but deadly. Apologies, my tummy's bad from all the coffee. Ew! Never seen this kind of interaction before. You can feel Pikachu. You can tell what Pikachu would be like in real life. You want to reach out and touch him and cuddle him, but don't cuddle him. Listen up. We got ways to make you talk. Or mine. Yeah. So tell us what we want to know. Pipe. Yes, okay, I can. Shoving, pushing. My problem is that I push people away and then hate them for leaving. He's saying you can shove it. What? I can shove it? Okay, that's it. No, we're switching roles. I'm bad cop. You're good cop. No, 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 no we're not cops. Oh. In my head, I saw that differently. <laughs> you want to find your pops? I'm your best bet. It's a new way of seeing Pokemon. But you have the magic, you have the iconic characters. Something like this is pretty special.